Herpless Shimers, Herpless Shimers. <laughs> bah! I can't stand children. They're the only ones silly enough to believe in Santa. It's toys that make Christmas fun, not Santa. Well, they certainly won't believe in Santa if they never reach the North Pole. And they won't reach the North Pole if they don't have tickets for the Polar Express. <laughs> and they'll never find these tickets before the conductor throws them off the train. <laughs> Isn't that wonderful? I want all those Herpleshimer's toys. I'm gonna ask Santa for all of them. Tickets, tickets please. I'll be coming back to check your tickets shortly. Make sure you have them ready. I've got my ticket right here. I, I, I can't find my ticket. I never lose my ticket. I always keep it here, safe in my pocket. My ticket, it's gone. I, I lost, lost my ticket. My ticket. My ticket. If we don't find our tickets, we're all going to get kicked off the train. It's standard procedure, you know? Everybody calm down. Now why don't you go and search for your tickets in the other train cars, and if the conductor comes by, we'll cover for you while you're gone. Okay! They might not be able to find their tickets by themselves. Maybe one of us should go and help them. Okay. You stay here and keep an eye out for the conductor. I'll go and help find their tickets. your ticket? I'm afraid to go in there. It's dark and spooky. A jack-in-the-box has my ticket and it won't give it back. Don't be afraid. If we go in there together, it won't be so scary. Do you know which jack-in-the-box has your ticket? I, I don't know. I was so frightened. I nearly dropped my flashlight when I was looking around in there. Okay, here's the plan. You hold the flashlight and I'll check the jack-in-the-boxes. Try to be brave. I don't like the dark much either. Uh, I'll try. That wasn't the one. No, we found it together. I couldn't have done it without your help. But hurry back before the conductor starts looking for us. Hey! 
Hey, what are you doing here? Well, I came to help you look for your ticket. Obviously. I know where my ticket is. There's a gang of nasty puppets in there, and they've refused to give it back. I'm not afraid of some old puppets. I'll go in there and get your ticket back for you. I've come to get my friend's ticket back. If you want to stop me, you better do it now. You'll have to get past my puppets if you want that ticket. <laughs> Take this. Get him. my puppets if you want that ticket. Take this! You'll have to get past my puppets if you want that ticket. Don't you know it's against railway regulations to throw objects inside the train cars? Well, they started it and was the only way I could get your ticket. By the way, here it is. Well, thanks for helping me get my ticket back. If I were you, I'd be getting out of here now before the cook finds out what you did with all that food. Good idea. I'm gonna go find the others and see if they found their tickets. I'm afraid he's going to be left behind all alone on Christmas Eve. <laughs> You're going to have to get past me if you want to pull this emergency brick. And I don't believe that you can do it. Do you? <laughs> the other tickets are. <laughs> you look like a good sport. 
The ticket you're looking for is on the other side of this train car. If you can get the ball past me, then you can pass. Let's play! very angry and he won't let anyone enter the kitchen. But I have to get inside because someone has hidden my ticket in there. Um, why is the cook angry? Someone messed up all the food he made. Now he's got to make more. Uh, yeah, that was me. But it wasn't really my fault. Those puppets started it. Don't worry, though. I'm going to sneak in there and get your ticket back. Okay, just be careful. The cook is not in a good mood at all. Get out of the kitchen! to do. I think this needs more sugar. I think this needs more sugar. He sure is in a bad mood. Here's your ticket. Oh, thank you. You're so brave. Mm -hmm. 
Duh, what a racket! They'll never hear you if you go through now. I'll rejoin the others. Hi! Have you found your ticket yet? I'm so glad to see you here. I can't get past this train car. The door at the other end of the pantry is locked. Did you look for a key? I searched and I found it, but... Promise me you won't laugh. I won't laugh. Some horrible little mice ran off with it. I'm really scared of mice. <laughs> hey, you said you wouldn't laugh. I'm sorry. Well, how about I catch those mice for you, and then we can search the next train car for your ticket. Okay, but I'll only come in once you've got the key. Mice were only wind-up toys. You shouldn't be scared of toys. Toys? Well, still, I'm glad you found the key because now we can go and look for my ticket. Maybe it's in the next room. Okay, we better hurry. Let's go. Wait a minute! I think I see my ticket. It's there, frozen in a block of ice. We'll need something to break the ice apart. Use that ice smasher thing. An ice smasher? That sounds cool. I want to try that. Okay. Well, just be careful. The floor is very slippery, and those blocks of ice look dangerous. Ticket? I sure did. Here you go. Thank you. There's one more boy up ahead. He must still be looking for his ticket. Don't worry. You head back with the others. I'll help him find his ticket, and the conductor will never suspect the thing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Guess who? Let's <laughs> go. Up here. I came up here to help you find your ticket. I fought puppets, dodged toys, smashed ice blocks, trapped mice, and even hit from an angry cook. Whoa! Now that's impressive. I hope you can help me. My ticket is locked in a suitcase in the next car. I found a key hanging by the door, but I can't get to the suitcase because there are these mean toys who... Let me guess. Those toys in there? They won't give you your ticket. That's right. They jump up and threaten me whenever I enter the room. You'll need these if you're going in there. Leave it to me. We are all going to the North Pole, and we need those tickets. I'm gonna get you. We've got to find those tickets. Yes, <laughs> Ticket. I don't think we'll be having any more trouble from those toys. They'll stay shut for a long time. We should go back and join the others. Yep. We better get back before the conductor throws us off the train. Blasted boy! Messing up my plans! Who does he think he is pushing us toys around like that? But I've still got a trick up my sleeve. Let's see what happens to the girl when she realizes she's lost her ticket. <laughs> They'll never find it here. We've all got something we'd like to say to you. One, two, three. Thank, Thank you for buying your ticket. Uh, that's okay. It was nothing, really. Okay. Well, if it was nothing, we should probably all sit down and stop blocking the car. Railroad Regulation 74 forbids passengers from obstructing fire exits, you know. You're such a know-it-all. He's right about one thing, though. We should get back to our seats. I can hear the conductor coming. 